In this lesson, we are going to speak about a new UI component introduced in Android Lollipop called CardView. A CardView, as you can see, is a component that looks like a card. So basically, this is a card with an image on it with some te text views. It has a shadow component and it has a background color component. So basically, we, we can create a list of cards. If you want to know how to implement this, just Google card view Android and click on the result creating list and cards. This is going to explain you first how to create a recycler view. We have done that part in the previous lesson. We know how to create a recycler view. So now the next step, if you keep a screen down, is how to create the cards. So our, our objective in this lesson is create a card and each card will be a link for the Reddit post that we are building in our application. So as you can see, basically a card view is a component that is in the support library. So the first thing that we have to do is import this in our application. So if we go to build.gradle, We go to the project property and we add a new dependency. We search for card view. And the latest one for me is card view 21.0.2. Don't worry about the version, just choose the version that you can see. It doesn't matter if the numbers are not the same. So we import the library. And now we are, ready, we are ready to use card view in our project. As you can see, this line has been added here. So, okay, now we just go to the view of our post. As you know, at the moment, we are just showing a linear layout with a text view on it, but this is going to change. What I want to do now is have a linear layout with a card view. So what I'm going to do now is copy the card view from the example. And I'm going to remove the text view inside it. And I'm going to add inside the card view or previous text view. Okay, if you don't want to copy from the example, you can import directly the card view and set a height and a width. And that's all you need to make it work. Now I'm going to change the, the width of the parent to graph content and I'm going to remove the background color of the linear layout. I want this card view to look something similar to this one. So for that thing I'm going to add an image view and I'm going to add the text view at the bottom. Then I'm going to have a margin between the two card views and I'm going to set the card view to fill the width of the screen. So starting with the change that we have done a lot of time in the course. So I'm going to go quick. So I just want to go to fill the parent of the card view. I want to add a margin of 5 dp between every card. I want to add an image view. So inside the card view and before the text view, I just add an image view. The height is going to be 150dp and I'm, I'm using just this icon as an example. So because I want our I want our text view to be after the image, mm -hmm. I'm going to add a margin top to the text view. So the text view can start after the image. Okay, so now this is something that looks similar to this. Okay, we are ready to continue. Let's see how this looks first on the emulator. We run the app on our Lollipop 
emulator okay and this is the expected result we see a car view with some margins of separation taking the whole screen with an image and a title in the next lesson we are going to see how to load this image with the link of the port